Hello everyone. This video is about, it's actually about two things. First of all, a small farming and money making method, and second, a summoning familiar that you get out off of that farming method. Uh, so first of all, the farming method is planting evil turnips, and you can buy the seeds. They're pretty much nothing. They're like 50 GP each in the G, or you can get them from monster drops. Or, uh, that's not important though. Uh, but what is, is that you can go and farm them here in uh, Draenor Manor. You can get their home teleporting to Draenor, or by just taking a cabbage ring and using the agility shortcut here. And the evil turnips take about four and a half minutes to grow. I don't think they die at all, like, similar to poison ivy, they don't get diseased. Um, I could be wrong on that, but anyway, they grow really quickly. And the evil turnips themselves sell for about 7k each, so it's quite good profit. That's 70, actually it's more than 70k, it's over 80k an hour just by growing them and picking them. So you can go there and alk or fletch or uh, you can bank and then teleport back every five minutes, uh, whatever you want. So that's a decent way to make money. Uh, and that's about it for the farming and money making bit. And now on to the summoning familiar. This is actually one of my favorite summoning familiars. The farming method is 42 farming, the summoning requirement is 42 summoning. And what the familiar is, is it's just the evil turnip familiar. You make it using crimson charms and you carve the evil turnips. Just right click on them and click carve. And then you can use it as the summoning second ingredient. And there, I don't know, it's just a really funny, weird familiar. Uh, I've, as you can see here on the screen, it's literally just a turnip that uh, has sort of a body and walks around. And then its attack is the really interesting thing. It breathes a fireball and makes whatever it hit, it, whatever it hits, will then breathe another fireball. the The second fireball doesn't do any damage, but it's I don't know, it's just really weird. It's one of my favorite familiars. Um, it I don't know, it's also actually a really good familiar for being only level forty two. I'm not sure what its max hit is, but I know it's relatively accurate, and it can also heal itself, which is very nice for a familiar. They don't often do that. Um, and it uses range attacks as well, which is nice because then you don't have to worry about get, it getting trapped on things. That's a sort of annoying problem for a lot of familiars. So yeah, that's pretty much it. Just thought I'd bring a sort of random little bit of RS to everyone's attention if they hadn't ever heard of it before. I don't think I've ever actually seen anyone using one of these, um, but that might just be because I don't really see a lot of low-level familiars in general. Anyway, I hope this was fun or interesting or something, so thank you for watching.